exposed. Security forces plot to attack Biafrans. Hip hop alleges end sit at home. The indigenous people of Biafra, hip hop, has agreed to end this proposed Monday sit at home exercise to protest the continued detention of its leader in Nambicano by the Department of State Service, TSS. In a statement signed and issued by IPOP's Director of Media and Publicity, Emma, powerful and made available to Politics Nigeria, IPOP warned that security operatives may unleash mayhem on innocent citizens and blames on the members of the Eastern Security Network, ESN, the armed wing of IPOP. The statement read in part, the intelligence of units of IPOP has uncovered secret plots by the Nigerian security agencies, most especially the DSS and the police to disguise as IPOP and ESN oppressive to attack traders who come out tomorrow for their legitimate business. IPOP states that there is no longer ghost Mondays in Biafra land in solidarity with our detained leader, Mazi Inamdi Kano. Seats at home would only be observed on the days our leader will be making appearances in court. Such days will be well publicized ahead of time. Everybody is hereby placed on alert about this wicked plot. IPO will not tolerate any attack on any Biafran or residents mm. of Biafran other guys. Security agencies have perfected plans to unleash attacks on innocent people of the name of ESN and IPO volunteers. We have no plans again to enforce any set at home order. We understand that all DPUs, DCUs, and other police senior officers in Enugu held meeting to perfect this plan to attack innocent Bia fans and target ESN attacks. The statement read Police warn IPOP against forcing residents to sit at home, vows to arrest any criminal. In the same name vein, the police command in Emory State has warned the proscribed indigenous people of Biafra, Ibo, against forcing residents of the Southeast region to sit at home. According to the news agency of Nigeria, none. The police, alongside other security agencies, noted that they would embark on state-wide intensive patrols as part of efforts to protect lives and properties over the sit at home order by Ibo. Recall that the hip hop group has fixed every Monday for residents in the southeast to sit at home as a shadow of solidarity to the leader of the group in Abdikan, who is currently standing in trial in court. However, the police warned against any groups or organizers of the sit at home order, saying we want any group of persons planning to disturb the lawful activities of lawful by no citizens to desist from it. In a statement issued on Monday, on Sunday, by the police command spokeswoman Lovett Oda, Commissioner of Police Ali Ugaba, directed area commanders, divisional police officers, head of tactical and operational units to monitor the group activities. The CP stressed the command's zero tolerance for lawlessness, warning that the security operative in a one state will deal with any group of persons that infringe in the right of law abiding residents in the name of a seat at home order. He urged the residents to go about their lawful activities or business without fear of intimidation or harassment. The general public, especially parents and guidance, should monitor and discourage their children words from engaging in any unlawful activities or criminal acts as long as the arm of the law will definitely catch up with any criminal in want. Hmm. Guys, so we have heard it all. So the people who are told to sit at home should obey the law so that more mayhem or havoc would not happen so there will not be killings because they say that if they catch anybody with any unlawful activities the person is going to be arrested so we know you all are fighting for your rights it is good to fight for your rights because you're fundamental human right and i support that but you all see you all need to abide by the law of the government give what belongs to Caesar to Caesar because if you don't do that many youth might lose their life many people might lose their life so I urge everybody to 
obey the rules of the government don't go out doing that day because i know you are fighting for your leader you are fighting for your rights it's your right to fight is in the constitution that says fight for your rights everybody has his own human rights but you need to play it safe don't say because of they are not giving you what you want now then you should be fighting when all those things is happening just with everything is going to be settled in nigeria you feel me i don't want all these type of issues to be happening in nigeria because we know you all are fighting for your rights and everyone wants to be on their own but you all don't take it in your hands because if you take it in your hands different type of things will happen okay so someone said that i don't care what is going to happen to me that i'm going to come out and fight for your rights i know it is good for you to fight your right but please do not go out because they say that police will be catching anybody that tries to do any type of unlawful activities during that day. Abide by the law. Wait for the future. Your laws, your your rights and everything that you want to be granted. Don't take everything to your hands. Because you know what happened last year. When the youths were protesting. Like what happened. How they killed a lot of people. Because the police we have now, they don't care about anybody's life. They kill people as if they are killing ants. I don't want to hear killings of people that people are dying every time because of this because they've already said stay at home nobody to go out so obey that because number one thing is your life first first see that you're okay when you see that you're okay then you have to do okay then you can continue fighting for your right but don't put everything into your hands don't fight because if you keep on fighting hmm, what things are going to happen and the police of nowadays they don't care like i said they don't care about anybody's life they will kill you if they want to kill you and the government will not do anything about it because the government will give them order to do what they should do so please i'm begging you all abide by the rules what you want is going to still going to happen just keep on praying for your for your for the beer fans keep on praying for it it's going to happen but don't put everything into your hands of saying that uh, no, I need to fight for my rights. And for my rights, and you go out and with them and meet, the person is dead.